You ready to fight? Ready. Do it. All right, so Charles Oliveira ready to get back to it right now. He has evolved his game into the most dangerous lightweight in the world, maybe the most dangerous pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the world right now here in modern-day mixed martial arts. All right, so there's that power right from Michael Chandler. He talked a lot about mixing it up this week, but that right hand is his weapon of choice, and he found the button early. It is his weapon of choice, and I think a lot of his success is based on the fact that he's such a high-level wrestler. So when he level changes, people tend to drop their hands, and Chandler drops that big right hand on him. I think this is one of the best athletes in the entire UFC. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Push kick there to the body. Oh, no feeling out process tonight. These fighters are brawling early. Those guys came to fight from the moment the referee said go. <laughs> See if he can make some adjustments defensively. Well, he's taking too many of these shots up top. I mean, he's got to move his head right away. He's waiting. He's being react. What a setup. He lands a beautiful flying knee. Just over three minutes to go. Level change there. Goes for the takedown. All right, rubber guard for him now, DC. We haven't seen you lean on this in the offline. No, I've, I, he's setting up the arm bar. Oh, he's got the arm in tight. Trying to finish the arm bar now. All he's got to do now is get his hips up into the back of the elbow to get the finish. Oh, now he's going to find himself in a little more danger. All right, so he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Oliveira's in half court. Oh, right into Mount. Mission attempt here, champ. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Oh, pinpoint strike lands there and not going to help the swelling upstairs. I love this accuracy, this ability to get his shots to the target right away. And you see it in the swelling that is forming on his opponent's face. Yes, yeah, smart adjustment. Yep. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the map? Oh, beautiful fight instinct there as he reverses position, and now he's got the dominant position. He did a fantastic job recognizing, man. I have got to get on the offense from bottom to top to dominant position. What a great job. He passes to half. Oh, postures up and delivers a big ground and pound strike to the head. Nicely done there by Chandler. Beautiful submission attempt here. Oh, good technique there. He's got the triangle choke locked in. Oh, he's got him. Oh, somehow, some way, he's able to get out. Look at that, Johnny. Gets to his side. That allows him to slip the right arm out. He gets to his back. Now, he's inside control, but he's out of that deep submission attempt. Chandler getting peppered here from the top. He's got to figure out a way to cover up. All right, he's got him in the north-south position now. I know the crowd thinks it's funny when this happens, but if you're the bottom fighter, uh, nothing funny about it. It's not funny. This is not a fun position to be in in fighting. You've got to try and change it immediately because you are carrying someone's weight, whether it's their bottom half weight or the top half. You are carrying their weight, whether you got their armpit in your face or you got their legs over the top of you. It is not comfortable. Trying to set up a choke here. That Darce is tight. He's got a 
side locked in. result here tonight by way of submission and he bided his time there he stayed patient waited for an opening and then when it was there he certainly capitalized to get the tap here tonight all right so a wild round and a wild sequence there on the ground dc talk us through the highlight he's such a phenomenal grappler i don't understand how people don't know that this guy wants to submit you he is the best grappler best submission specialist we've seen in a long time all right here one more time the veteran voice is bruce buffer Ladies and gentlemen, the referee has called a stop to this contest, declaring the winner by submission due to a Darce choke, Charles...